All right, Holden has been dying for me to make him a YouTube video of his playroom. So I am tired of him asking, so we're just gonna do it. Anyway, here is his playroom. And I'm gonna walk around and tell you a little bit about it. We got a fire truck, and this fire truck was actually given to him as a gift from a complete stranger. Yep, a few years, a couple years ago. And we got this John Deere uh, gear toy, and we got this actually from Ollie's, and he loves playing with that because he can move the gears around a little bit. Uh, one of his little balls that his nana bought for him, so he can kind of sit around and and bounce and watch TV and just kind of relax a little bit. We got a BB-8 robot that um, he got for Christmas from Nana. And here is his step two, and you pull the, we use this as an activity table, but it also pulls out, and it is a, like a little Hot Wheels car set up, up under it. And he loves to play with those as well. Under it, let's pull this out. Got this from Walmart on one of their clearance sections, and it's a Playmobil uh, pirate set. We have not put this together yet. Though. We're gonna wait till a rainy day. To put it together when we're bored so we just kind of put it up and we've got quite a few lego sets that that we have gotten over the years and when we found it cheap or somebody got gave it to us and we're just going to put it up for rainy days and holden loves this book he always says his nana better not find out that he's reading it and we have to hide it when she comes to the house and we're not going to say where we hide it in case she watches this video do what Yes, oh yeah, because it has a guy smoking a pipe, and that's just not good. So we're going to hide it, but Holden absolutely loves this book. And I've got this from Goodwill for $1.49. And here, up under this, we put a bunch of his action figures. A lot of these are sorted. We have a lot of Todd McFarlane characters, uh, hobby kids from parties which we have to go there quite a bit while they got YouTube videos um, we got Venom we got all kinds of different stuff Hulk a lot of these are like classic toys that actually um, I actually bought and had them on the wall for years and decided you know what I'm too old for that and my child could just play with the toys I don't care how much they're worth some of these are actually probably worth a good bit but just don't care we only live once I'd rather him just play with them and here is his little reading book that um that I got him. And the horse, the big giant horse, came from his nana. And the big lion came from his nana as well. And I use those to kind of house him in here. And this is actually a, a beach and um a beach and a, a a house toy that we got from Ollie's. And it's a um I think it's a a big Joe, yeah. It's a big Joe. Um a toy and or not toy is a big joe uh, like a beanbag thing that he can actually sit and read his book but i made him a nook out of here so he can do his homework and just read his ar books and believe it or not this is one of his favorite books and this the movie came out not. it's not one of your favorite books okay he just likes a couple stories out of it and got this really cheap because books a million had it for like ten dollars they had one copy that was like six ninety seven, so they actually had to give it to me for that price. But all the other ones were a little bit more. Um, over here, got him a, a little bookshelf. These are not all his books, but, but some of them. After his, his, um, his mom and I got divorced, uh, she kept some of his books and I kept some of the other ones. And got the little shelves from Walmart. And the first book he ever got was The Complete Tales of... Um, and and poems of Winnie the Pooh, and I got him this one. When my wife, ex-wife, was still pregnant, and um, that's the first book he ever got. Over here, we got our Star Wars stuff. I got this is a really expensive toy, normally like a hundred dollars. Um, got it on sale one time at Walmart for like I think thirty dollars. It was pretty cheap. But we got a bunch, bunch of toys in here. Some of these come from Goodwill. Uh, we love going to Goodwill to do his little Goodwill hauls and I give him like $10 or tell him he can buy like five or six things and he loves it. And over here, 
we've got, um, I started it. I need to go back and get all those color books over here and put them in here. But we're gonna use this Georgia bucket that I got from Lowe's. We're gonna use it for his color, color books and his crayons and everything. Over here is his ball pit that is like his favorite thing ever. And we are slowly filling it up with balls. Try not to buy a bunch of them at one time because it gets kind of expensive. So every now and then I'll buy him a bag. We'll get excited and throw them in there. And on our shelf here, as we just keep adding toys to it, but one of Holden's favorite things is this planetarium. And those are pretty cheap. You can get them at Walmart for like $20 or less. Um, some more books. And over here, we've got his iPad, uh, um, a um, little thing for him to hold his iPad in. I got, and I actually got this from school. They were selling the, the little books that come every few every few weeks or a few months. Um, his Joya doll, his autistic Joya doll. My son is autistic. Um, he's high functioning Asperger's and he just loves Joya. Yeah, he can really relate to her. Um, we've got Spider-Man here. This is our Pixar shelf. Yeah, it's got a little bit of Disney too. But but we are um, we're gonna uh, we're gonna keep adding to. It. Oh, we forgot this one. Got this from Goodwill. Just got it yesterday from Goodwill in Tifton. And this one is a little clock, and it works, and it actually tell, helps you tell time. Hello, how are you? I'm Kelly, the Peking Time Clock. And it will help him learn how to read a clock. Got Spider-Man, got that from um, Goodwill yesterday from Tifton. But I'm telling you, if you don't go to Goodwill, you need to go. Your kids will love it because it doesn't cost much and they really get excited just to get new toys that you know, will not break the bank. And this shelf here is our little stuffed animal shelf. Again, these are just some of his stuffed animals. Um, um, his mother kept quite a few of them as well. Um, we've got our, I have no clue where this came from, but it's awesome. And our little lightsaber there. His big giant Paw Patrol tower and that came from his Nana as well. And I got this, um, one of those Facebook markets, but could not find this anywhere. I've been trying to find this toy box from Little Tykes um, and could not find it anywhere. And I think I paid $10 for it. So yeah, it might not be in perfect shape, but it doesn't matter. Still holds it. And we got quite a few action figures in here and he tries to keep all his cars in there as well. Here is his table. Um, and this is decorated from Holden. He just put whatever he wanted to put on there. So I have no clue why it's there. It's just there. And the trampoline, the little tight trampoline. I bought this so to keep him from jumping on the furniture. Um, he doesn't do it at my house so much, but he does it his name is quite a bit. Even though he doesn't really jump on it much, he kind of uses it to swing back and forth, but hey, keeps him busy. Um, yeah, we got our dog here. That is not part of the playroom. Don't know why he's in here. And a troll doll that we got from Ollie's just yesterday. And the rocking horse here, this came from his Nana and we decided just to put it in here. And our little alphabet floor, and Holden loves this one because he said he could play with the floor. He just has to put it back. Because all the little feet, all the little letters actually will move up and you can take them out and play with them. Here is another one of his toy boxes. We have quite a few other toy boxes in the closet too, which kind of run out of room in here. And our big, this is another one with Star Wars. Huh? that normally is really expensive. One of the deluxe um, ships and got this for, I think 20 bucks. And it's normally about $75. Walmart clearance, you can't beat it. That stuff is great. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and if we add any more, he's gonna make me do another one.